Joining us now to talk more about this is Jamie Kreitzer. He's with the North Carolina Department of Transportation. Jamie, good morning. Thank you for joining us. This is another ice storm for portions of your state. What are you guys seeing this morning that is most concerning? Good morning. Good morning. Yeah, uh, we so we had a lot of rain and some freezing conditions overnight, and we're seeing quite a bit of ice on our roads and bridges this morning, uh, basically from the Raleigh area all the way down to the coast of North Carolina, where you guys are looking there in the Newburn area. Um, so we've we've been urging people uh, to not travel in much of North Carolina because temperatures are just not expected to rise above freezing in many areas, and that. That's going to be the case at least for the next several days. And, and we spoke yesterday to uh, the Fayetteville Emergency Management Coordinator, um, Scott Bullard, and he was mentioning how black ice was going to be a concern overnight heading into this morning. And now with some of that precipitation falling, if temperatures are below freezing, as you know, Jamie, we're going to see the ice on those roadways. And um, as I understand it, this isn't even the worst of it. This is just the beginning. Yeah, you're right. So last weekend we got hit with a storm along our western edge of North Carolina, you know, western side of North Carolina, and and this uh, this storm that that uh, first started last night and then is going to uh, continue again today and into Saturday is going to hit us largely in the central and in the uh, eastern side of the state. So we have advised everyone stay off the roads because the roads are going to be very icy. And you mentioned black ice. In the mornings, uh, especially, it is treacherous on these roads, and uh, and and no one should drive on ice. Uh, you, you can't see it, and many times with black ice, it's too late. Uh, you know, before you can do anything about it. And you know, echoing the words of of what what's coming from the Wilmington, North Carolina weather office this morning, they're talking about this ice storm warning, which is in effect for the city of Wilmington. It's been a few years since we've seen that issued in the city of Wilmington, but they're also Jamie saying that travel could become dangerous, if not impossible. And the weather service always carefully chooses the words to use. And when they say the word impossible, especially along the coast, Coast, I think that's important for the people there along coastal North Carolina uh, to take heed. You'd agree, correct? Yes, absolutely. I'm, no one drives on ice, uh, nor should they. Um, it, it's just far too dangerous. And, and frankly, the conditions we're seeing in North Carolina now, uh, for a lot of people, they're really rare, uh, particularly down at our coast, that, that typically tends to stay pretty temperate and warm throughout the year, um, even in the winter. You know, it's warmer than other parts of the state. Well, that's not the case now. And so people need to uh, need to hunker down and uh, and spend time with family. Enjoy the snow uh, near where you live, uh, but uh, but but stay off the roadways. It's, it's just too dangerous to be out there. And and uh, we have, you know, 900 employees in our contractors right. who are going to be out there, you know, clearing roads and stuff like that. So uh, it let us work and and uh, stay off the roads. I'm Amy Freeze. Welcome to Fox Weather's YouTube page. We have more great videos on the way, so make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all things weather.